Hey, it's your girl Naya. And shout, it seems like Cardi B is waiting around for Nicki Minaj to drop her fifth album, as Cardi has been postponing and giving her fans the runaround. Cardi B's last album, Invasion of Privacy, was released in 2018, and we all know how Cardi B came into this industry to take down Nicki Minaj, which was orchestrated by her record label, Atlantic Records. This has been revealed by many other female rappers who were paid to go against Nicki Minaj, such as rappers Cupcake and and Lady LaShore. Leash, is it, is it actually true that you got offered 250K to write a diss track for Nicki and you turned it down? What? Yeah, it is, yeah. What? Are you only hearing about this now? I what? remember hearing about it at the time, but I've never had a chance to actually to speak rumor. to you about it. Oh yeah, no, literally, yeah. Genuinely, that's what happened. Uh, and that just came from me doing a cover of Look At Me Now, you know, Busta Rhymes. Mm. It went on World Star, and then like Atlantic Records wow. was trying to reach out. Fast forward, I'm sitting down in front of this guy with my manager at the time, and um, he's just like, yeah, we, we basically want you to do a diss track to Nicki Minaj. This is after I played him my whole like EP or whatever I've got coming out. And it's like he just he didn't really care about it. And um, I just knew something wasn't right. And um, I went away, I'm not gonna lie, I went back on the flight home, I was bawling, because I'm thinking, yo, this might be my only opportunity to get my mom a house. But um, yeah, I'm glad I didn't, because fast forward, then Nikki, Nikki invited me to her exactly. tour. Although Cardi kept mentioning she's working on her next album and that it would be released in 2019. But baby, it's 2022, what's the holdup? Well, on a more recent note, Nicki Minaj mentioned her upcoming fifth album will be released in 2023 and to follow with a worldwide tour towards the end of the year. It seems like Cardi and her team, aka Atlantic Records, definitely caught wind of that as Cardi B announced just a few weeks later, as stated on The Breakfast Club, I have no choice. I have to put it out. No. It's missing. Yeah, I, I, I gotta put it out. I gotta put it out next year. Like, I feel like, I don't know. So what do you think? First quarter? Are you gonna wait until April and do like uh, the, the anniversary of Invasion of Privacy? You drop on April 6th again? I think I should, I think I, oh, you guys are tricking me. I think I should put it out like around that time because it's like, <laughs> it's not even about putting out an album. It's like putting visuals. Yeah. Um, it's, Cause it'll be the five year. So fans believe Cardi B will release her sophomore album right after Nicki's album release next year to compete in numbers and sales. But the real gag is Nicki can drop whenever she wants because she isn't under management. Unlike Cardi B, where she has a 360 deal with Atlantic Records, so it goes according to their plan. Oops. Well, here's some tea that I've heard, but Cardi B's label had to withdraw some support until they re up from all the money they invested into Invasion of Privacy. Well, fans base their opinions on Twitter as they tweet, Cardi having a screenshot of Nicki's documentary in her phone basically told us she's waiting on Nicki to release her album first. Another fan tweeted, I don't think Cardi is waiting for Nicki's release date. I think she's scared to flop because her only song released this year didn't do well. Another fan tweeted, Cardi knows the whole hip hop community is waiting with a bated breath to see what the second album is gonna do. And we the barbs are ready to drag her by her lace front. Ciao, but what do you guys think? Could Cardi B and her label be waiting for Nicki Minaj to release her album to compete in sales and numbers? Let me know what y'all think, but the tea does not stop here.